guys welcome back to my channel it's curls with chris here and today we are going to be doing um well i'm going to be doing a mini sephora haul that i did um over the course of two weeks time where i went to sephora twice and i was like you know what let me show my peeps what i got from sephora so um so yeah i got a bunch of good items um based off of recommendations and just other uh what other youtubers were saying you know worked for them and sometimes i have a hard time um purchasing things just because you know it's, it's hard when you don't know what you're actually looking for but when someone gives you a recommendation you say hey you know what i'm gonna go get that so if you're interested to know what i bought on my recent sephora trips um keep watching okay so for my birthday my birthday was in august remember i did my chit chat get ready with me i picked up my um my birthday gift and one of the one of the gifts was the brazilian bum bum cream so i got that um and the it comes with the brazilian bum bum cream by soul j it's by soul de janeiro and um it also comes with the coco cabana cream and the brazilian bum bum cream now it does smell really good I have not tried it yet, as you can see, it's still in the box. But you know, I have so many like body products right now. I just figured I would just wait until I use all of that stuff and then I would move on to this. One, that is the only um, body product that I got recently. So that's gonna be the only one in that category. Um, the next thing I got was recently, I just got this. It was the brand Clean Reserve. Eau de Perfume, Parfum, and in the scent Radiant Nectar. Y'all, I have terrible, terrible, terrible allergies. Like my entire area right here, my sinus area, like I can barely even go outside without um, like sneezing, my eyes watering, my eyes itching, I'm having like a mucusy throat. So I'm like one of those people who take allergy medicine um, every day because I just have to so this perf I normally can't wear perfumes because they irritate my my sinuses so they make me sneeze I just repetitively sneeze but this particular perfume it smells so good it's very very light so if you have you know very easily irritable sinuses like I do this brand clean reserve is going to be um for you and so the next product that I got was the Fenty Beauty um, Stunna Lip Paint. And I got it in the color Unveil. This is the actual packaging. It's not, that's not the color that I have on today, but let me show you what this color looks like, y'all. It's so pretty. This is the color. If you can see that. I know, I feel like I always just wear like a neutral brown. I feel like it just looks good on me. So this is about $26, I think. I think, I'm actually not sure and I don't have the receipt to give you the actual price point of it, but it's so long lasting and it's not like drying, if that makes sense. So I really, really like it. The next product I got is the Too Faced Born This Way Matte 24 Hour Undetectable Super Long Wear Foundation. Now, I it's oil free, oil controlling, waterproof, and transfer resistant. So I got this because um, Jackie Ina recommended it. I am the color Chai. And just a little backstory, it's very hard for me to find foundation colors that match my skin because even though like I said, I've said this numerous times but if anybody is like a new subscriber you don't know but um I am brown skinned but I have yellow undertones and most people have like a red undertone so it's very hard to find stuff sometimes to fit my complexion it's very it's very odd but um this has coconut water in it so it does feel really really conditioning and smooth but it it's just feels so good on my skin so even though it's mattifying i don't feel like my face is just like stuck in one place so this is actually a new fave for me i actually have this is the color chai that i have on right now and um yeah this is this is it right here i was using the urban decay as my normal everyday foundation but i think this one right here is basically going to replace that i think it's between 30 and 40 dollars i'm not quite sure but i will have all of that information um in the description box the next thing i got is you know you all know i love the tarte 
creaseless concealer and I use the color deep it's like 58 or something this is about $20 20 or so dollars and um, it's very thick which I like about it so what I use up under here is I use the Maybelline fit me that's the one that I that's my like normal one but I, I use that no matter what but when I need extra coverage like today what I did was I basically use the Maybelline fit me and then I use this right under on the creases right here where I normally have like my under eye issues and so what that does is it just gives me extra insurance it's thick but it's also creamy and it um if you let it dry down what I don't just put it on and then pack it in I let it dry down a little bit sometimes I'll like um blow my face with my hands a little bit fan my face blow my face fan my face a little bit and then I'll um I'll blend it in and this is what the finished looks like once you have on your um, setting powder. So this is like, I'm never gonna stop using this. It, they had another one before this one and it came in a different packaging, but I do actually like this packaging better. So the next thing I got is the Sephora brand Glossed and it's just a simple clear um, lip gloss. It's nothing to right home about here oh before i move on too far let me show you guys what the uh, thickness of this concealer is if you can even tell this is what it looks like um so it's very thick this is actually i have hardly anything on here and i can actually like draw with this this is the it's not very watery at all so that's good but anyways i just wanted to show you that um this is just a regular clear lip gloss i have not opened it yet but you can't go wrong with like a clear lip gloss like this is like an everyday mascara and lip gloss kind of day thing so this is about ten dollars so when i sometimes like i have a lot of clears that have like shimmers but i really wanted something just for just can throw it on this is this is going to be this for me this is going to go in my pocketbook yes i said pocketbook because i'm from virginia <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna go in my pocketbook and yeah that's what it is um i got the kat von d everlasting glimmer veil liquid lipstick this color again it's like um neutral this is the this is in lolita and i feel like lolita is just like you can't go wrong with lolita yeah this one is in lolita i feel like they have a lot of different versions of lolita but um this is the color of it I feel like um, this one is a little bit more shimmery than the other one that I have that's Lolita, the liquid, um, the other like matte lipstick. This is the color of that. And I just figured if I'm going out at night or something and I kind of want my lips to have a little bit dramatic on the inside, this will be good. So this is what the packaging looked like. This was probably like $7 on sale. Um, it's the Glimmer Veil, that's why it's different. So it can be like a topper, I'm assuming. That's what I'm probably gonna use that because I use this already. Um, the Fenty Beauty Lipstick in the Mademoiselle Lipstick in Flamingo Acid. And this is the color that Rihanna wears a lot. And I went, it was one left, it was on sale, it was like 10 bucks, so you know I had to get it. This is what it looks like. Like I said, I've already worn this. I think I wore this like the first day I got it. This is the coloring of it. Let me put it, swatch it for you. Oh, it's so pretty. If you could get this color, I would like just recommend that you get it. First of all, the packaging is, how adorable is this? This is the color right here. It's just so pretty and it's very soft. It doesn't make your lips feel dry because I've worn it twice already and I absolutely love it. Um, I think it was about 10 bucks for that one. So go get it if you can get, go to your local Sephora and they have it on sale, I would recommend picking it up. So the next item that I got is the, the Benefit Roller Eye, Bright, Eye Brightening, Brightening Waterline Eye Pencil. So this is the packaging, I just opened it. And this is what it looks like. This is what it looks like it actually is very pigmented. This is what it looks like. And this is actually the color that I have on my waterline right now. And I really, really like it. Um, Jackie Ina was recommending, y'all know I love her. I know y'all get sick of hearing about her, but I'm sorry. I mean, she knows a lot about makeup. So I listen to her a lot. Um, 
she recommended not getting like a stark white um, liner pencil for your bottom waterline. So what I did was this color is I don't know what the color is the color is um 9cb i think that's the only thing that could be the color because it's not written on here but um yeah it's a brightening waterline eye pencil so maybe this is the, i don't remember if they had other colors but this this is definitely um worth getting and it was so easy to get on even on the first application and this was actually um 20 dollars this one was twenty dollars, and the clear the clear lip gloss was ten dollars. So this was twenty. So also, what I got this one was not this was not on sale by the way. This was regular price. Um, I also got the Sephora I Love palette. This is the color scheme of the palette. If you can see, let me show you when I open it. I have not used this yet. This is what the packaging looks like. Very cute and small. Definitely can be used for travel. I feel like it has a good um a good blend of shades for neutral and like pops of color so this is what it looks like so i will be using that this was on sale i want to say that was about ten dollars as well those are called these this color is they're considered jewel tones that's what they are um, so I also got another palette. I got the Norvina Mini Mini Pro Pigment Palette Volume 1. So I have a, another Norvina palette that I like, and it's very bright, very bright colors. But um, nonetheless, I still really, really like it. This one is, the packaging looks like this. This is what the box, the box looks like. It looks just like the package. Um, it's so pretty. And these ones also have... Uh, very bright colors but you know what i'm gonna start venturing into the colors guys i'm not gonna keep doing the news every time even though it's my favorite and it's the easiest to do i am gonna start using colors so this is the color the colors that they come in and i don't have any of these colors i feel like in any other palette so i think that this is gonna be good for me um for the rest of the sale stuff that i got skincare products because um, I do have a Clarisonic and I don't know if you guys heard but Clarisonic is um, no longer going to be making their products. No MIAs, MIA2s, none of the brush heads, um, none of the, I love their skin washes, their face washes. They're just amazing but they're not going to be making them anymore. So when I saw that they had um, brush heads on sale for $10, I politely went and got four of them. So I have three of them here. I got the um, deep pour brush head for enlarged pores because that's what I have. I'm always struggling with cleaning out my pores and um, hiding them. So I got these, I went ahead and used one already. Um, and you're supposed to replace your brush, your brush head every three months anyway. So I felt like this would be a good um, purchase, justifiable purchase, if you will. And the last product that I got was the Clarisonic Detoxifying Clay Mask. It's a weekly treatment to decongest and de detoxify your pores. So this is the packaging. It's basically like a gray mask. It's, it gets very hard on your face, but it does really clean out your pores. I have used this once because I was very anxious to see and I was pleasantly surprised. But like I said, I love Clarisonic's products anyway. So yeah, this was just uh, me wanting to talk to you guys about what I bought because who doesn't like seeing what people bought? I know I do. I love when my sisters buy stuff. So I'm like, what, what's in the bag? Show me what it is. But um, yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have made it this far in the video, go ahead and subscribe. I mean, I don't know what will be stopping you. I'm cool. I'm fun, I'm doing hair, I'm doing makeup. Go ahead and subscribe to my channel and you won't miss um, any other videos from here on out. That's a pretty good deal, I think. So um, again, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did filming it and I will see you guys in my next video.